Hi and welcome to our next short video on area where we're looking at the area of a parallelogram and rhombus. All right, so if we look at a, a, a parallelogram, parallel, a parallelogram is a quadrilateral with opposite sides that are parallel and equal in length. So if we have a look here to our um, with our parallelogram, you can see that the two opposite sides are parallel and both of these are actually equal in length. Now to represent that, we generally see some strokes across the lines and the same amount of strokes would represent the same length. Um, technically, if you look at, uh, if you think of a rectangle or a, a, a rectangle, for instance, that's a parallelogram as well. The opposite sides are parallel and equal. The formula for a parallelogram is it's the base. So the length of the base from here to here and the vertical height. Um, and that's the formula for a parallelogram. So if we have a look at our, excuse me, if we have a look at our example here, um, we, we're going to just show the calculations for the um, area of this parallelogram. We've got the base 10, height 6, so what the area, so we've got our diagram. Next, we're going to put in the formula, so the area equals the base times the height. Then we're going to substitute, so area equals 10 times 6, area equals 60 centimeter squared. So we need to be able to identify these two parts of our shape in order to actually calculate the area. All right, the next shape we've got is a rhombus here. Now a rhombus is basically a, a special type of parallelogram. It's a parallelogram where all four sides are actually equal in length. So another example of a rhombus is a square, like similar to what a rectangle is a parallelogram, a square is a rhombus. Now with a rhombus, there are two ways we can actually um, calculate the uh, area. We've got uh, the base times height of our um, parallelogram. We've also got this formula here, which we will see for another shape, which is called a kite. Um, but we'll go with the base by height uh, formula here because they're, the, they're the, um, the measurements that we've actually got for our shape. So depending on what information we're given, that's what formula we can use. Okay, so find the area of this rhombus. Okay, so the area equals base times height. So the area equals the base 2.3 multiplied by the height 2 in meters. So the area equals 4.6 meters squared. All right, really, really simple. All right, thanks for watching that. Hopefully, you got something out of learning the area for parallelogram rhombus and we'll see you in our next video.